You want some? You want some? You want some, eh? Hi, Berg Australia. I'm Tina. I'm Callum, and this is Athletes and Athletes. Tina, what is it like to be the first female Muslim boxer to represent Australia in the Olympics? It is an incredible feeling, breaking those stereotypes and barriers to be representing my community and just showing the world that you don't have to dress like any certain way to be representing the country. You know, it's all about how you perform and not what you wear. Callum, you're one of the first Indigenous athletes to be representing Australia at the Olympics. How does that feel for you? Very exciting, Tina. Um, you know, I get to show my brothers and sisters out there anything's possible. If you put in the hard work, the dedication and determination, I'm happy to show them that, you know, brothers and sisters out there, just get it done, get that gold medal. How's your preparation leading up to the Olympics? I'm really excited. I mean, we've got our America trip and then we've got our Europe trip. Pretty much travel all the way through to the Olympics. Yeah, I know that I'm, I'm going to miss home a little bit, but yeah, Same. the preparation's going to be intense. What about you? What Are you, are you going on all the camps? Yeah, I have yeah. to. You must, uh, well, that's the only way, you know, get the fights, get the experience with the international boxers. To fight the best, you have to be the best, so. Yeah, exactly, yeah. What challenges have you faced leading into the Olympics? Well, it's being away from home. I'm a homebody, so I, I love being home around family, around my dad and my coach. But what about you? I feel like I've faced a lot of challenges. People thinking that I, I'm not capable of becoming a boxer. I don't look like your typical boxer. I don't even, whatever, whatever that looks like. You know, I do wear the hijab to be the first, you know, Muslim boxer in the hijab to represent Australia. So it's, uh, it's quite challenging and I think um, Stepping out of my comfort zone and, and being that role model and showing people that I can do it. Just getting stared at, I think, was was really challenging for me as well. Yeah, there's a, there's a few challenges there, but um, you've got to face those challenges in order to succeed. So that's why we're both going to the Olympics. What are you looking forward to in Paris? Win that gold medal, baby. Let's go. <laughs> me too. We're coming for that gold, Callum. Go, we're going go. for that gold. Thank you so much, Berg Australia. See you in Paris. <laughs>